So guys, what's going on? I hope you guys are well. I hope you guys are staying safe. I hope everything's good wherever you guys are. Guys, as you guys are aware, smash the like button. You guys know the score now, by now. Uh, smash that like button for me, please. I really appreciate it. It really means a lot if you smash the like button. Uh, guys, so we've got some breaking news. A fight that I've been talking about for a while. You know, it's been back and forth, but it looks like now it has been agreed. Dimitri Bivol and Gilberto Ramirez agreed for November 5th in United Arab Emirates. So it looks like it's happening in UAE. Um, let's see what's... Uh... So the WBA light heavyweight champion Dimitri Bivol and his mandatory challenger have agreed to deal to fight on November 5th in United Arab Emirates. As such, the purse bid that was scheduled for today has been cancelled. So Eddie Hearn confirmed this on Twitter. Uh, it says here, Dimitri, the WBA have confirmed the World Boxing Association action between Dimitri Bivol and Gilberto Ramirez. Due to be held on today was suspended. Both sides reached an agreement to fight on November 5th in the United Arab Emirates. Uh, so this has been confirmed by the WBA. So it looks like we've got a fight uh, on, uh, which is great, great news. Look, this is a fight that... I think um, is going to capture the imagination. Uh, the fact that it's in UAE, I'm quite surprised. I didn't know it was, it, you know, it was a fight that would really make a lot of sense there. I don't know. Maybe I don't get it. I don't get why it's in the UAE, to be honest with you. Um, someone must have come up with some money. I don't know for, for the fight because it's a bit of a bizarre location for a fight like this, which really, I mean, neither guy is from that part of the world. I mean, I don't see I don't see the I don't see the connection for this fight to be happening there but you know so maybe someone maybe maybe someone's come in with a with uh huge amounts of money an investor or something and they feel that it makes sense make, having it in UAE but yeah it's a great fight it's a great great fight it's a fight that I think uh will definitely make a lot of sense it's a big money it's a big big um money fight for um, both guys and the fact that it's happening in UAE I think tells me that there's going to be a lot of money involved there um, it like you know who's got the deal because I know Gilberto is with Oscar and obviously Dimitri is with Eddie Hearn and Eddie Hearn's the one that confirmed this going through um, so it's interesting it's very very interesting to see how this develops in uh, I mean who's got who's got this deal done in for the United Arab Emirates uh, very, very interesting. Let's read on. I mean, what does it say here? So this is really talking. I mean, this article is talking about, I mean, it's talking about the, the fight itself. I mean, yeah, I'll do it. I'll do a different video for the fight breakdown. Um, but yeah, uh, what do you guys make of this fight happening? Uh, Dimitri Bivol and Gilberto Ramirez. There's no purse bids which means that the, both parties have reached a deal uh, to fight in United Arab Emirates. Um, I, think it's, I think it's a much better fight than what the other fights that were being uh, touted. I mean, the Boatsi fight, not really. I wasn't really that interested. Uh, I think, there's, I think there's, um, there's a narrative that can be sold here about the fact that, you know, Gilberto Ramirez wants, uh, he wants revenge and the fact that uh, for Canelo... And uh, I think that could be sold that way. And if, if I think it's a great opportunity for Gilberto Ramirez because if he wins, um, he becomes a superstar and a Mexican superstar, in my opinion. Because, you know, the, let's be honest, uh, Dimitri Bivol just beat the biggest star in Mexico and probably the biggest star in boxing. And if Gilberto Ramirez can somehow pull off the win, uh, imagine where his stock rises in Mexico. I mean, he becomes an instant superstar, an instant, like... Uh, uh, you know, instant star in Mexico. So, you know, it's a great, great opportunity for him. And I'm pretty sure he wants to go in there and and uh, put on a great performance and beat Bivol. I think I think if, if, if um, Ramirez beats Dimitri Bivol, he changes his life for good. Uh, so it's a, it's a, a great opportunity for uh, Gilberto Ramirez. It's a great, great opportunity. I mean, uh, you know, he's got a perfect opportunity to put, you know, put himself on that next level and he's fighting somebody that you know is obviously very buoyant very confident you know coming off his career best win against Canelo Alvarez uh in a pretty dominant fashion I mean like he won the fight pretty com comfortably um so you know I think someone like Bivol is going to be hard to beat at this point because 
if you look at it out of everyone in the light heavyweight division this guy's got the most credible win really when you think about it because although Canelo wasn't a light heavyweight I think apart from better be and Bivol you you'd say Canelo beats every other light heavyweight I don't think there's a light heavyweight out there that beats Canelo bar um bar Bivol and better be I think Canelo has enough to beat everybody else um so in my opinion I, I think this is a this is a, uh, a a great fight a great fight that uh, makes a lot of sense for both guys and hopefully hopefully we as we as fans get a, a great fight you know and i think that's what we're waiting for so yeah the fight's on uh gilberto ramirez and dimitri Pivo. guys just to let you know i will do a breakdown of this fight i mean let's do a break i will do a breakdown of this fight this was just a video just to say that it's 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 official i don't think it's been officially officially announced but it's kind of been agreed from both parties so i think this is what's going to happen i think there'll probably be announcement soon um but yeah it's great to know that uh G dimitri bivol and gilberto ramirez has been agreed and it looks like this fight will take place november 5th in united arab Emirates. leave your thoughts guys let me know what you think in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next video peace